Welcome back to Dr. Rose Helps You Here. I'm Stephanie Rose and I'm a hearing life audiologist. Today we have Emily back, our harpist from last week. She experienced the real one versus the zircon one and decided to take home the real one. So today we're going to get her feedback on what her experience was for the last week and she just had some real ear measures done in the Genie software. So hopefully everything will go even better after this, but let's just see how she feels about the new technology. Okay, Emily, so what was your experience with the Real One hearing aid for your left ear over the past week? How did you like your harp? How was work? How did it all go? It was great. Honestly, so one thing about the hearing loss, um, especially as a speech pathologist and a musician, is that I get tired of listening, and I did not feel as tired this past week which is a big deal for me. So that tells me that the hearing aid is working really well. Um, I do work with some kids that are a little bit more difficult to understand and I was a lot was a lot easier um, this week. And then I normally when I play the harp and I have a hearing aid, I have to take it out, but I didn't take it out this week. It sounded so much better, a lot more natural. Yay, oh, I'm so glad to hear that feedback. Thank you so much for coming. And maybe we'll touch base again at the end of your trial period just to see yeah. how, how the real ear measures made a difference, if any. So thank you so much for yeah. sharing. Okay, Emily, one more thing. I wanted to kind of take it back to when you were wearing the Zircon one in, in clinic last week. And, you know, my apologies, everyone. I somehow did not recover the real one demonstration with the harp. I'm so sorry, but when, when if you could just see her face when she had that on and she undampened the harp and played it loudly, um, what was the biggest difference that you heard, Emily, between the, the first one and the second one, which was the real one? Um, in terms of music, when I, the Zircon, it was like kind of like a basic hearing aid. So I heard that like feedback and every time I played, it's like, ah, ah, <laughs> my ear. Um, and typically my hearing in the past, I just take it out because it really bothered me. Um, but the Oticon, the real, I didn't get that. It was a lot more natural. Um, music wise and then speech wise, I can understand um, Dr. Rose so much better with the Oticon real and I thought it was worth it. Yay! Oh, thank you so much for sharing. A lot of people don't realize that the level of technology really does impact the quality of the sound when we're talking about complex signals. And in my opinion, a harp is a very complex signal. So I'm so glad that you heard that difference. I remember with the Zircon, you were saying that it was kind of crackly and then with the real one, it wasn't crackly anymore. Like it just kind of released all of that peak clipping and what yeah. we call peak clipping in the, in the business. So yeah. So glad that you were you were impressed with that. I'm super impressed. <laughs> okay, thank you so much for sharing. And there you have it, from a real harpist herself, she chose the real one. I'm so happy that the My Music program is bringing musicians lots of joy to play their instruments and not have to worry about quality of sound.